Hello artists, I'm going to share a book with you today called See a Heart, Share a Heart, and then we're going to create a heart with found objects. So I'm going to start with a story and then think about some things that you might have around the house that you could use to create a heart shape. This is by Eric Telchin. These are all found hearts. Looks like somebody went on a treasure hunt and found all these different things that look like heart shapes in nature. See a heart. Share a heart. So if you put your hands together, you can make a heart with your fingers. Catch a heart. These are little shadows. Hold a heart, free a heart, find a heart. So next time you are going on a walk around the block, just look at the leaves and the flowers and see if you can find hearts in your environment. Fill a heart, oh, that looks like a balloon and a crack in the cement. Move a heart. So the butterfly wings make a shadow when we get some more sun. Make a heart. Hide a heart. Looks like tree bark and the paint on the cement. Lose a heart. Twist a heart. Break a heart. Miss a heart. Wonder if little insects chew through these. Mend a heart, warm a heart. Tend a heart. These are all, looks like all from people's gardens. See a heart. Share a heart. Touch a heart, change a heart. And then this is the, the author of the book. Looks like he has some more on this page. These are more um, brownish, grayish. This one is really bright. So um, we're going to start with a just piece of paper, it can be any piece of paper, and you're just going to draw a big heart shape in the middle. And then I want you to look around for some things that you can add to your heart. So I'm going to be using all different kinds of supplies that I have around, and I'm just going to start building things and seeing if I can, almost like a puzzle to see if I can fit some things in. To fill up this heart shape. I have some of these caps from old markers that I don't use anymore, but I saved these because these are fun. A lot of fun colors. I'm like I borrowed one of my son's Lego pieces. Let's see if I could fill that in. And there's also really neat stuff that you can look around in your neighborhood. I found a rock. And here's a leaf. Piece of bark. I'm trying to fit everything in. Here's a few buttons that we had that have come off of things. And let's see what else do I have here. Oh, I've been cutting out pictures of flowers from the mailers that come in to our house. So I can use those, cut out some of those. If you want to draw pictures, you could draw pictures to put inside of your heart too. Maybe of someone in your family. Oh, that one will fit right there. Maybe I'll add some more of these here. And these are all things you can find. It can be anything. Oh, we did it. We filled up a whole heart. So see if you can find some things and create a heart. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.